Here we have eight different graphs and we want to determine which one of these are functions and which one are not functions. And uh, what we're going to do is use the uh, vertical line test and the reason why the vertical line test works is because every x value can only have one specific y value. Uh, let's go ahead and bring in this vertical line. So uh, when I place this vertical line over this diagonal green line right here in this graph, it could only cross it one time. So as you see, as I move it from my right to my left, uh, it's only crossing it one time. And uh, that means it is a function. So this first one's going to be a function. Uh, the second one, if we move it over the circle, you'll notice that the, the vertical line is always crossing it two times. So that means it's not a function. Okay? The only times that it would cross it one point would be like if you put it at the very end, like right there, and if, if, if this vertical line was like tangent to the circle, it only cross it once, but still it's not going to be a function because if you move it a little bit to the left, then you'll see that it crosses at two points. So uh, a little bit more about that is like, say if I, I'm going to keep it there and I call out a point and I'm just making this up, but say this is like one and then two, this point right here would be two comma, I don't know, I'm making say three. Okay, well then this point down here has to have the same x value, right? We go over it two times, so that's going to be 2 comma, I don't know, it would be negative, say like negative 3. And then uh, if we plug 2 into a function, supposedly, uh, we'd get 3 and then we'd get a negative 3, but that can't happen, you can only get 1, so that's why it's, uh, it's not going to be a function. So um, let's go ahead and get rid of all this and we will uh, move on over here to the parabola. So I'm going to move this vertical line from right to left and you'll notice that it only crosses at one point so this was a, uh, this will be a function as well. If I move to the right for the sideways parabola you'll notice that it's always crossing it two times so um, that's not going to be a function. Okay, Coming down here to the horizontal line it's pretty obvious that it, it only crosses one time so that is going to be a function. Uh, the vertical line though, if we place it over it, it continuously crosses over it, so that's definitely not going to be a function. Uh, this hyperbola, if we move it over uh, to this left side, you'll notice that it's always crossing it two times, so uh, it's not going to be a function. Even if you move it to, the, uh, to this right side, again it crosses it two times, so that's not going to be a function. And then lastly, the ellipse is really similar to the circle. Um, every time you know, we move it from right to left or from left to right, it crosses it two times, so this is uh, not going to be a function.